today is finally the day for going diving in those ojos. First, they said we gonna go two days prior, then they said we go afterwards, but now is the day. Thank God, uh, you can hear it, my cold is better now, and I'm so looking forward to this dive. It's a dome with one hole on top where mm -hmm. it's where the bats get in. Here. So we're gonna start in this line going in and back. But look, it's darker this this line. After 20 minutes here, I'm gonna call you, you follow me, we swim here and we go up. And then we're gonna see the huge room. There are thousands of stalactites. It's beautiful. Okay, and then we find the line again. And we start diving in the open cenote, the big one, and we cross back. And that's it. And it would take, say, 40 minutes. So the equipment is already prepared now and the instructor told me about everything. Um, now I'm going to dive in two different cenotes and these are two routes. The first is called the Barbie line and the second is the, is the, is the, is the, I will tell you afterwards. Now I have to think about so many things. I'm so excited about it. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it now. Yeah. <laughs>
finished the first dive now as you can see it was freezing cold so the first dive was the barbie line in the dos ojos um at first i went into the water and it was it was amazing i thought that i'm really like in a movie because the water was so blue and i've never seen something like this before um yeah then we made a short checkup if everything is fine if i feel fine and i felt fine until we went into the cave then i said no no i have to return i have to return because my my, my brain was like okay now you're gonna die everything was dark and I've never seen something like that before. I never did something like that before. And then I, I had to turn. I really had to turn the dive instructor. It's, it's, oh, are you okay? Are you fine? No, I need some minutes. I always need some minutes. And then I said, okay, breathe in, breathe out. You were able to do it. And then I was able to do it. And now I'm really happy about it because it was amazing. But as you can see, oh, it's really cold now. Now it's time for a break and then the next dive. Now I also finished the second dive. The name of the of this dive was the Bat Cave, and the name is because you're diving, yeah, underground, and then you you uh, go up and you're in a cave and this is full of bats. I don't know if you can see it. Hopefully in the video, because it was amazing there. It was really cool. I've never seen something like that before. Yeah, it was a bit creepy. But it was cool and then we went back there I had some problems with my ears but the second dive was much more relaxed than the first one thank god it was so cool and it was the best decision ever to make the diving license because you can you can see so many things which you wouldn't have the opportunity when you're only snorkeling so guys if you have the chance make a diving license and go snorkel and go diving all around the world 